I am Rodonna from boysandgirlshairstyles.com. Um, today I have Lisa with me and we are going to do a fun mohawk cut on her. Uh, we do want to leave these slides a little bit longer um, depending on which haircut you want. If you want to go shorter, the haircut that I'm going to show you, you can go shorter. Um, hers is going to be medium length, but we are going to cut it over her ear and we are going to leave this long and then we're going to just chunk into this so she can kind of wear it this way and then we're going to have it a mohawk um, this way. And we're going to start in the back and we're just going to chop into this. Don't want to even cut on this back. There you go. All right, now through this top, this is where we're going to come and uh, put that mohawk up. We're going to take this, it's just over an inch long on this top. And like I say, you can take it as short as you'd like. If you want it shorter, they're darling short too, so way short. We're going to leave Lisa's just a little bit longer. Okay, um, through this area, I am going to tighten that up to her head, which means I'm just going to bring that shorter in this way. Just going to kind of keep this tight to the nape. I am point cutting into this. Um, you don't want any straight lines in this cut. Okay, come back up to the top. Again, keep this close, closer than up here, to the nape area. And we had a request for this cut, which is awesome. We're so glad Lisa is a fun person. Well, let's do it. <laughs> She's always willing to do something fun. work you know from the middle to the right then I'm gonna go middle to left okay again I'm gonna take about that much off angle it down Make sure you hold all the way up so you don't take any length off of this because we still want this kind of shaggy back here. Just make sure you hold that up so it doesn't take that length off. Okay, just hold straight out 90 degree angle on the sides. slide by the ear. I'm going to hold that out, but I'm just going to point cut into this. I don't want that I don't want that way short, so I'm just going to do a little bit. Just so when you comb this, you can see that it's just kind of messy right there. It's really piecey. Okay, then you can go from the middle and then down this back on the left side. shears but I'm also going to use a razor and if you want to do a shorter mohawk um, you can take that razor you know around the hairline more and things like that um, I am going to use a razor we're not going to go as short okay. and just hold that straight out and when that falls just have that piece piecey. Okay, so we have all that cut. Now we're going to come from this hair. We're going to hold this hair up. 
Here's your guide point. You're just going to chop into this. Again, don't make it even. Okay, so you just want to pull from about here, just pull this straight up, okay? Same thing. Let's turn her this way. <coughs> okay. All right. So now we have this, and we're, we're going to texturize this. Okay, then we're going to come from this part to your side. Just going to do a 90 degree angle. Pull that straight out. Okay, pull this straight out too. Not straight up, kind of. Okay, let me show you. You're not going to want to hold it straight up or straight out this way, just right in the middle and just chalk into that. Okay, then these sides, again, we don't want to take the length off this way, so we're going to hold out and just chop into it this way. Okay, now we want this cut over the ear. So you're just going to bring your shears up, just go straight across that ear, right above it. Then hold that ear down, come back behind, take that hair off, and just chop into this. You can see here how this is long. We're just going to take our shears and come into this, just so it's not all one length. but yet we leave the length right there. Okay, now we're gonna to come to this side. Again, hold that straight out. Okay, come by the ears and hold straight out. Just connect the sides right here with this top. So that's PC. Then come up here around this ear. Okay, there you go. All right, now for the front, gonna hold those down, chop into those so they're not all the same length. If you're going to do the shorter mohawk, you can hold these bangs out and really chop into those or take your razor to that. Okay, I am going to bring the razor in now and I'm going to start up through the top and I'm going to come about halfway in between that hair, kind of C-shape that out. Just kind of wanting to do it through the ends because you want this... Um, like really piecey at the ends. That's what's going to make it cute. Okay, and you come up through these bangs. Actually, I'm going to do a little bit back here. You can just run that almost like you're combing it in the back. Okay, now thinning shears. That's the key about this haircut and the PC look is texture. You want tons of texture. 
And Lisa has a lot of hair. Um, it's very thick. It is straight. There's no curl to it. Gotta love that, all right, Lisa? Right. No body. That makes it fun though, because that's why these haircuts work for her. <laughs> okay, so check out our next video, and I will show you how to style the mohawk. Hi, I am Rodonna from boysandgirlshairstyles.com. Um, we just cut a fun cut on Lisa, and now I'm going to show you how to style it. Um, love the Amp Mousse. It's the Ad Volume, and this is um, from KMS, California. And I love this because it gets on the hair strand and it swells it. So we're just going to apply that all throughout the hair. Okay, then a new fun product that we haven't showed you guys. It's called Blast. Okay, and this is from Ice. This is where distortion comes from also. Um, this is from Ice and this is a spray adhesive. And what I'm going to do is through this mohawk, mohawk part, I'm just going to come through and I'm just going to spray a little bit through there. And you'll see why after I dry this, because it's totally going to make it stay. So you want it to stay, this is the product to use. Okay, so I'm just mainly putting it through our roots right here. Okay, then I'm going to start this. We're just going to leave her back down. And up here we're going to kind of dry this up. Just dry your sides down. Like I say, up through this crown area, you're going to want to kind of go up with the blow dryer. This is a super fun cut. Really fast and easy. Okay, so all of that down. The crown up. The sides down. Okay, now through up here, you're just going to bring your blow dryer in. And you just go up with this, pull out it in the middle. That product, it just holds it right into place. You don't even really have to do much with it. Um, Lisa, we're just going to kind of piece these out in the front. If you want a shorter mohawk, you're going to have your short pieces up through here, okay? And then same thing, same way to style it. You style it all the same. It's just if it's shorter or longer. Okay, I'm going to use my ice distortion. Come up through this. Piece out that front. And this is fun. You don't want it like a mohawk, but just have it PC. Just pull out at this back. Okay, and piece out those sides. You can see how it makes it look nice and wispy and really cute. Okay, and then just take my finisher spray, just spray that, and that's how you style the mohawk cut. Um, super fun and fast and easy.